lights go down in the Carolinas. As your eyes now. How did I meet Jason? I actually uh, I met Jason at a singer songwriter conference in Cape May, New Jersey, um, last year, and. At that point, I was I was just sort of starting down the path of, of deciding that I was not going to self-produce this CD, that I was going to work with someone else on this one. Um, and he gave a talk at this conference, just just kind of like not, it, it wasn't pitching himself as a producer even, it was just talking about ways to look at music, which it really, it, it got the gears in my, my head turning, and so when it came time to, uh, to choose a producer, I... I thought, okay, you know, it, this guy seemed to be on the same wavelength as me on a lot of things. Uh, but I know he's very, you know, he's very picky about the projects he chooses. He doesn't do that many every year. So I shot him an email, laid out everything that I was looking to do, the the looping, you know, the fact that um, the songwriter, all of, all of these like elements, uh, reminding him of where we met and all that, and got an immediate email back like, I get it, I understand exactly what you're doing. This is going to be fun. Let's do it. Um, so almost to like to the day a year after I first met him uh, at the uh, singer-songwriter convention in Cape May I was back at that singer-songwriter convention um, again hanging out with him and right after the convention was over we headed back to Harrisburg Pennsylvania um, where he lives and where he runs seventh wave studio and headed into the studio the uh, the Monday after that and spent two weeks working on on uh, on these records so it just everything fell together the right way I met the right person at the right time and when I was ready to make the record he was ready to work with me so it's uh, it was kind of a perfect storm